Hey there, it's uh, Mark Derricket here. I uh, just thought I'd record a quick, um, short little screencast uh, video of um, using Frega and OSGI. Um, this is just part of my little hacky experiments in learning new languages and new environments and playing with stuff. So on Friday night I wrote myself up a little um, Frega Maven plugin so that I can build Frego code is part of a normal project, and uh, that's now on Maven Central, which I've mentioned in some previous posts on the blog and elsewhere. And this evening I thought I'd just uh, have a go at trying to get something working with um, OSGI and seeing how modularity works with Frego. Now, let's just see what we've got here first. I've got my, um, I've just created, actually, so I've created four projects three projects and Apache Craft, which I've just downloaded and unzipped from the website. So inside my Frega lib project, I've just got a Maven pom file, and that just declares the that I'm going to embed the Frega library and export that as an OSGI module. There's no code, there's no services, there's nothing. That's just all it is. And uh, the other two projects include a billing library, which let's just uh, see what we have here. Um, so inside my billing module, I have uh, one file called customerbilling.fr. So if I look at that, um, where are we? So we've just got a simple module here that declares two data types, a bill, which has a, an amount, and a customer, which has a name, an email address, and a list of bills. I'm also declaring a discountable class that has a, symbol, a single method or function to calculate the, a, a discount value. Um, we don't currently have any implementations of this, and there's no code here that actually does anything. So, um, let's just start with... OSGI. So we can see here that uh, I have no bundles or anything installed. Now. The first thing I need to do is install the OBR bundle repository management tools. So I can now see that I have no repositories added and no nothing. So I can add a repository to my local repository which doesn't currently exist because I'm working from a fresh install of fresh setup of everything. So if I just uh, install the Frega lib into Maven, this will build and deploy it to an OBR repository and actually create that first repository entry. Um, let's see what we got here. Okay, now that's built, so I can now OBR refresh. I can add, and I can see I've got my Frega library. So now if I go to my Frega billing, and I can install this library, Now this will install just those two data types and the class as a separate jar file that will be deployed in independently, versioned independently into OSGI and will be the basis of our modularity system here. Um, 
let's see what we got. We that all works perfectly. So I can now list. Oh, no. So if I refresh, I can now see that we have two libraries available. Now the third library, which is where things start to actually get really interesting, is our fridge calculator. Now inside this module, I have one OSGI activator, which is written in Java, and my Frege calculator, or Frega calculator, written in Frega. And what does that have inside it? Let's have a look. Get rid of that for now. So this is just one module which imports the customer billing from our previous dependency and has a main function which will just print out our customer name and our discount. And we create a customer called Mark that has six bill six bills in its list. And we call discount for that customer and we'll print it out all kind of nice and simple. So let's go and build this. <clears throat> now due to a, a strange way of how the Frega compiler currently actually works, I currently generate the source files into the source main Java directory just so when working with IDEA or Eclipse that uh, my Java source can actually see the generated Frega code. But um, as we can see here that the build actually failed because my calculator class doesn't actually implement the discountable class which as we saw in, when we wrote that it didn't actually implement it. So, this is where I just actually removed that code from here, just to demonstrate that. So, we could actually add this back into the original module on the billing module, but I'm going to add it here. So, this is in our calculator, which is has not modified the original jar we're declaring an, a discountable instance for customer with a calculation. Now I can rebuild this and Maven will, all being well, be completely happy and will tell us that uh, Freya and OSGI dependencies is working as one would expect and that it's compiled and ran all beautiful. That's now installed into our OBR repository. And we can switch back to OSGI, we can refresh, we can list, and we see that we have three artifacts in our repository that we can deploy. So I can then go and deploy Fridge Billing. Oh no, Fridge Calculator. And so we can see that we've installed Fridge Calculator, but that also required that we install Fridge Billing and Fridge Lib. So now we have three artifacts installed, and we can start our. If we start them all, Fridge there, Fridge Calculator. we can see that our activator has actually run our code and given us our result. That's pretty cool. So that demonstrates to me that uh, Frega is a r very good language currently and seems to work really nicely for OSGI. Um, we're type safe, we've got uh, solving extensible classes with different modules without having to modify the original classes which is something that's really big for me that is something that is actually just a complete mind blower um yeah that's pretty cool that is 
that is pretty pretty cool so that's currently my little example code I haven't looked at trying to do anything with uh, OSGI services or things that require instances but I'm not sure I care currently this is Mark signing off, just saying that this was a, a wonderful success, successful demo and successful little, little code hack. Now I've got to go back to the drawing board and find out what I actually really want to do with this code. See ya.